It's your boy, Big E. It's your girl, White Jones. And we are the Critical Crew. And today's special guest happened to be Phil My Swag. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're in the building. I wouldn't even call him a guest, you know? He's going to be more like family, baby. He's going to be family today. So, Mr. Phil My Swag, Mr. Don't Make Me Fuck You. <laughs> Oh, damn. That's what they calling me now? That, that, that's that's what they calling you right now. I mean. <laughs> so, my boy, those that don't know who you are and what you about, because uh. you make, you're making moves. <laughs> you're making a bunch of moves. You know what I mean? You, word, you, word. You, you all over the air with that song. Yeah, word. Now you got a new song Definitely. Yeah. right now uh -huh. that's buzzing that's all popping. around CT. <laughs> but the only facts. thing I want to say, let's, let's go and tell the people who you are. Well, I feel my swag. I'm originally just a regular dude, but I started doing this music um, last year, January. Yeah, you know what I mean? That's it. Yeah, it's brand new, like 14 months. You feel me? So I'm doing that. You know what I mean? Now I'm out here. I do a lot of art shows in the city. You know what I mean? I put on for Bridgeport. I put on for the state. You know what I mean? I do anything, man. I'm around for everybody. You know what I'm saying? I support everybody. But right now, people probably know me as a musician, which is like new to me. But fuck it. So you only been so so you mean wow, to tell me you only been rapping? It. You only been rapping for about a year that's and like crazy. three, four months? What's today? The twentieth? Yes. Nah, it ain't four twenty. Nah, definitely ain't four twenty. Definitely ain't four twenty. Yeah, that's you, what I'm thinking about. You're on his way. <laughs> he right, he like, I ain't hold up, hold up. Yo, speaking of four twenty, um four twenty, I'm actually gonna be on um performing with Waka Flocka and um DJ Who Kid. Wow. I'm four twenty at Webster Hall, sold out. Oh, that's what's that, up. That's a move. That's, that's a what's word. up. So, yeah, yeah. You, you you said you do a lot of art shows. For real. So on top of you being a rapper, yeah. you do a lot of art shows. That's like new. Yeah, like, word. Like, cats in the hood don't really don't understand do art. <laughs> nah, nah so, go ahead, go ahead. So how did you get into doing art? You got an art background? Like, nah, I don't got nothing. <laughs> I just, you don't I have nothing? I just, me, I go, I just, yo, Biggie, I just... Dive in. Like, I don't even know how to swim. I'm just diving head just first with nothing. So, yeah, so, check this out. I hope you use a strap. Oh, of course. Here you go in since here you dive go. in. Yeah, hold on, hold on. Here you go. I'm saying, I got it. Here you go. Not that hard. We talking about here different go. levels. Like, yes, you know what I'm saying? Here you go. Shorty. Oh, we leveling. All right, we leveling. Yeah, yeah, we leveling. Like, levels of diving in. Like, you know what I mean? Go ahead. I ain't going to dive all the way in. You know what I mean? But listen, listen. Um, The art show is like, it's, it's non traditional at all. Like, it's not your traditional art show. Wow. And like I said, one day, I said, yo, let me do an art show. Like, you know what I'm saying? I ain't know nothing about art shows, nothing about nothing. You know what I'm saying? I'm just like, yo, let me get the pieces and hang them up. That's it. Somebody was like, yo, you know, who's going to curate the show? Who's going to hang this? Who's going to do that? Who's going to have the wine? I said, I don't know about none of that. I'll pay for anything out of pocket. You feel me? So I pay, I, wow. I pay for like, um, I think it was like 20 bottles of wine. And then I just hung up mad pieces like from local artists because I know my network is Crazy in Bridgeport, so I know everybody. Like, that does what they do. Yeah, yeah. So I got up with all the graffiti artists, like the best graffiti artists, and I got up in the biggest gallery in Bridgeport that is not for graffiti. Are you yeah, listen, they not for graffiti at all, and they hate graffiti. So I said, yo, you know what we gonna do? We gonna put graffiti, graffiti in there. <laughs> so we, we took, we wow. Took, we took the whole gallery. We had over 100 pieces. Uh, bottom gallery, second second floor, and like over 500 people showed up. Are you serious? Yeah, over 500 people showed up, and Everybody from and it's crazy because the demographics is not from Connecticut. They coming from New York, so everybody from New York is looking at Reeds as the attraction of art. Wow, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, it's crazy. So that's crazy. <laughs> you did you popped off with the art thing? Yeah, that's crazy. made that crazy. Yeah, word. <laughs> so you do understand there are gonna be some people that's gonna bite your style. Yo, listen, people you, people try to eat. Like I've been to like. People tried it because nobody doing art shows. And like I said, my art shows ain't traditional. So when I do it, I'm smacking them with like 15 DJs. Not mm -hmm. one DJ, 15. 15 like you, you you, name a popping DJ from the area, he was there. Wow. You know what I'm saying? Like And like I said, like I said, I don't charge nobody for no admission. Drink as much wine as you want. Drink as much liquor as you want. You know what I'm saying? Are you serious? You're just putting on for your community. <laughs> yeah, basically. yeah, wow. yeah. Because like, you that's know what I mean? serious. Like yesterday, yesterday's show was disgusting. I was say, didn't you have a show yesterday? Yeah. Art show yesterday. Oh, oh, oh. that wasn't no typical <laughs> that wasn't art no show. Typical art nah, show. That, <laughs> that was no typical art show. <laughs> that was crazy. It was like. So tell the people that haven't been to one of your art shows, what are they looking to a, see? You listen. Put it like this. Yesterday, I just came to the conclusion it's a it's a a day party with art on the wall. <laughs> 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 A day party wow. with art on the wall, yo. That's it. It ain't even wow. an art show. It's a whole day party. 
but you but you me? got all demographics of people. You got old white people. You got little kids in there. You got everybody in there. You know Tell saying? them what kind of art show it was yesterday, though, oh, bro. Yeah, yesterday was uh, um, it was a uh, four four twenty <laughs> get high show. You know, what I'm saying? so weed so show. All, all the art was all no. weed art. So marijuana yeah, everywhere. Every High Times magazine pulled up, Connecticut Post pulled up, News Twelve pulled up. You know what I'm wow. saying? So everybody was there. And like, you rap and put together an art show that's yeah. having all this. <laughs> no, no, no. He's not a rapper. Crazy. He's not. He's not a rapper. He's not a rapper. He doesn't have art. Oh. <laughs> so I don't do so, so He has none of that. <laughs> Yo, I, I like that. I like like, that. I just wake up and like, you know what? Yo, I want right, to be yo. this, and that's what I'm gonna do. I never it, thought about it like it that. It must either. be that cloud. Yeah, word, Is word. it that cloud? Yeah, yeah. It's that cloud, brother. Yeah, yeah, Cause yeah, at word. the end of the day, I I don't smoke. That but all. this young man is coming up with some phenomenal yeah. ideas off the cloud. Yeah. I think I'm about to start smoking. <laughs> I think it I'm might about be to start the Patron smoking. talk. It might uh, be the Patron uh, talk. Brother, <laughs> Patron, if you're listening. He's not a rapper. Patron, if you're listening. And he me. got one of the hottest songs in the streets so right I now. Yeah. Oh. I, I had to, you know, I had to do my research. Not yeah. the, the but but why Jones? Not only the hottest song, he has 26 remixes off that one song. Oh, 73. Oh, how many? 70. 70. I, I, I I dumbed it down. What? I apologize. No, 26 Bridgeport remixes. Oh, that's what it is. It's 73 <laughs> overall. Yeah, yeah, overall yeah, remixes to that one song. This ain't even like it ain't even hit the national level yet. This is still tri state. Like, but I got people in on um, Philly who did a remix. I got somebody in Florida, a dude in VA did a remix. You know what I mean? Jesus. Are you freaking serious. Yeah, that's now, all crazy, how, yo. <laughs> I don't want to tell who, how you do it. What What is your process to pushing your music? Because Ooh. this is incredible. I like, do it, I, listen, I do it like this. Everybody, like, I always see. A whole bunch of people pushing mixtapes, mixtapes, mixtapes. So I'm like, yo, all right, that's cool. That's cool. You know what I'm saying? But, like, what I'll do is I'll push the single to the point that somebody be like, yo, you don't got nothing else? You feel exactly. me? Exactly. Like, and now they're going to know me for that single. For that single. Yeah, they're going to be like, oh, that's not been so that's Don't make me, you know what I'm saying? Uh-oh. You know what I mean? Yeah. Uh-oh. But don't make me blow up. Like like hot fire last year like this deep, wait till that song. Now that was that crazy. one of the first songs that you dropped? That was, yeah, that was ever. My first song. Your first <laughs> ever. Song. Yeah, January first, two thousand fifteen. I'm done. Ever. Like, I don't, <laughs> we need to drop my. You got some cats <laughs> out in these streets. <laughs> January, is... Yo, January first, two thousand fifteen, first song ever, and it was a drunk freestyle. All I do, I, I, all I do is get drunk and freestyle. I'm right now, you know what I'm saying? So, so can you remember your lyrics? Yeah, I mean, yeah. A little bit. I hear a little bit. But like a I said, the, the name, the hook was, don't make me fuck your bitch. Don't make me fuck your bitch. Don't make me fuck your bitch. Hold on, hold on. And I wanted to ask you that. I had to ask you that. And I'm glad you brought that up. That was up. a diss track, man. So at, <laughs> at the end of the day, was it something that pissed you off or somebody that pissed you off and you looked at this dude and like, yo, you better stop playing with me because your shorty's giving me that eye. Yeah, nah, it was a shorty. It was her. She was doing it. You feel oh. me? It was she all, was doing it? It was all her doing. It oh, was, my. You know what I mean? And, feel Jesus. Me? Did, you, did you tell her thank you? Because Ray J thanks Kim all the time. So oh, I'm Lord. trying to understand, did you say thank <laughs> oh, you Lord. to this young lady who gave you that ammo to, to give you that? Uh, I mean, it was. I can't really say it was her, like, but that's that just came off the top. Like, was it? Was you know it? Was saying? it? Because, like, Big E, think about it. No disrespect. Say that you're walking with somebody, you got a shorty with you. A dude is probably saying in his head, "Y'all don't make me fuck your bitch." Ooh. And then wow. vi vice versa. Ooh. You see, you see, you see, you see me with a shorty, and somebody be like, "Yo, my nigga." Don't make me fuck your bitch. Ooh. Oh, you know oh, what I'm saying? Oh. So it, it, to me, I just feel I like... made that blunt. No wonder why you have this shirt on because he is he is giving he's giving us the L real deal. Listen, I, I don't know what his his blueprint is. Uh, no, but knows. We need to find out what his blueprint is because <laughs> 73 remixes yeah. all over Connecticut. In different states. Oh, that's crazy. And in different states. Different states. About to jump on the wave because that's only right now yeah, in CT. Yeah, crazy. And I know that song gonna pop. I know it's gonna pop. And you got another song out right yeah, now yeah. That's, that's buzzing the over the airwaves. Yo, yeah, listen, it's funny because we did we laid that down January 15th. You know what I'm saying? So you January was your shit month. I, I I try to do everything senatorial, like on the first and stuff okay, like that. Okay. You know what I mean? But the like I was actually late, you know what I'm saying? Cause I already dropped it on the first, but I was like, you know what? I, I, I was about to quit rapping. Oh, shit. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Yeah, I said, hold on, hold on. I said, nah, hold on. Because, listen, I started in January, so I dropped a mixtape called Six Months to Mixtape in June, because I was rapping for six months. Uh -huh. And I was going to drop 12 months the album, and I, I just stopped. You know what I'm saying? I just stopped. Oh, he just 
I, and then I said, I'm about to quit rapping in January. Like, that would be my one year of rapping, and I'm done. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. I said, I'm done. So he had a one year plan. Basically, like, I'm going to pick this up, show y'all how y'all do it. <laughs> I'm going to quit yeah. and let y'all yeah. follow me. Yo, dog, there are some people that have like, been like, rapping serious, for years. Yeah. I'm not understanding this. There's some brothers out here, sisters out here that have been rapping for years right. and are still waiting for that one hit. Radio play. You <laughs> just did it, like woke up one day and said, you know what? I this dude rap. been pissing me off or this chick been <laughs> pissing me off, man. And I see a man, he's smiling in my face. Don't make me fuck your bitch. <laughs> that's a hook. Yo, that track Let's crazy. do it. Yo, that track was crazy. But that Snapper Insta was just, that, that started off like I was downtown, Bridgeport, and this girl was like, yo, I know you. You feel right? I was like, yeah, it was good. So then she whipped out an Android phone and tried to take pictures Whoa. and shit. But then the, the when she when she took the pictures, they was mad blurry and shit. I'm like, yo. <laughs> oh, all right. nah, nah, She's like, nah. take another one. I was like, yo, you know what? Forget it. No pick. Like, no pick. Just straight like you know that. What I'm saying? I said, yo, no pick. We're not going to take a pick. Like, yeah, I can't pick. Because like, it's been like, bubbles. It's like, it was like blue four. Or white. She took like four blue picks. Blue and gray. It's that me? light. It's that, it and must be that light skin thing. <laughs> and that's why I said that on the track. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, no pick. Wow. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, all the wow. you, you discrimination over the Android, though? Nah, listen. She, listen, I ain't got no. It's Yo, not, he <laughs> apologized all his Android fans right now, okay? Yeah, he better. He apologized. There's a nah, bunch nah, of Android right fans nah, that listen. are deleting Don't Make Me Your Bitch <laughs> and the other song right now. Nah, so, so Android, I got fuck with y'all. Like. What's the new hit that's on the radio right now? Oh, that's not an Insta. That's crazy, yo. That's, that's getting. I. I never seen a, anything like that song get played mad now, times on the radio. Is that the one that got distribution? Yeah, okay. I got the yep, I got a digital distribution distribution through Shadyville. So, wow, yeah. that's what I said. That was big to me when I seen that. I yeah. was like, wow. Yeah. And that's that that that's what your boy uh, Livewire yeah. to DJ Livewire. Yeah. Shout out to DJ a, Livewire. Yeah. Where we, he said he was gonna be here, but you know, yeah, I get on him. That's he's about to um he's actually. Like it's getting crazy because his CEO is hitting him up. Like on, he's on top of me. Like yo, so they actually want to sign me. To wow. Them, like, you know what I'm saying? But, so uh, now I, let me ask you. Wait, hold on. Let me that. ask you. If you get a deal, will you just wake up and be like, I don't even want to do this no more? Because there's some people that yeah. slave. Yeah. And go really? Yeah, yo, listen. Like if you listen to any of, any of my other interviews, like I did my which I have. Interview, that's why I have like, to ask. What I what I say, I give everybody the same. Response. I'm going to be like, yo, listen, as soon as I get this bread, I'm going to flip it and buy my houses. That's what I do. I buy my houses. You feel me? So I'm going to oh. flip it and buy houses. So you actually wow. a landlord, too? Yeah, I got So on right top now, of the rap, th- I got 13 crazy. tenants, man. You got how many? 13. So hold up. On top of this man art, is, this man is right, yeah. bo- on top of <laughs> rapping, yeah. you're a landlord, too? Yeah, we're. Then shout you to, flip shout, houses. Shout out to all my, all my tenants in Waterbury. Wow. Oh, you in Waterbury? Yeah. You ain't buy nothing in Bridgeport None. yet? Never. Yeah, Waterbury's love right now. Waterbury is yes, love. Yes, it is. I, I, can't, love I can't lie. It's a very wow. great market. I love Waterbury. Wow. You know what I'm saying? I'm actually, it's Waterbury's treating me good. Wow. Wow. <laughs> you know what I mean? This dude said tenant. Yeah. Tenant. Art, art show pro- yeah. uh, I don't even production. Ask for, I don't even ask for rent. You know what I'm saying? I wait till, like, it's late. Okay, this is what we going to do. So <laughs> I need an apartment, right? <laughs> <laughs> you don't ask for rent. <laughs> I need an apartment so she don't ask for rent. Nah, nah, nah. I don't ask for rent. <laughs> I wait till it's late and then I ask. You understand what I'm you saying? You wait till it's late. Yeah. You and better you... understand this. You was about to have so many people right, hitting like you. I don't need to ask for rent. Oh, whoa. They don't even yeah, want right. to hear the music. They want to hear what, but, what, what listen What is you crazy got. because, like, yo, mad people be hitting me up for apartments. I'm like, damn, y'all don't know nobody else to hit up? Yeah, cause all my shit is taken. So I'm like, yo, y'all don't know nobody else to hit up. So I, it just makes me want to get more spots. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> If you need investors, what in if you, the world, you yeah, know, or, I didn't know. I swear, this is this is new to me. What? This is what I didn't catch. Oh, you didn't catch it? No. So you ain't know I was a foster parent either. What? Wow. <laughs> Stop the Hold up, time out, time out. The first Stop question the I asked this man was, tell the people for those that, <laughs> that don't, don't know, know you who, who you are. Yeah, it's a lot of things, so you're man. a foster parent, yeah. which is a wonderful thing, yeah, because at Kids the end of the day, yeah, I, I, I truly think more brothers yeah. should get involved. I try with, to tell all my boys. Not only in foster, but with their own kids, because especially That's if you have me. a little girl. Yeah, you bro. know, you have a little girl, yeah, right? Two of them things. You know, she got two. He got two wow. little girls. I have two. You know, why Jones has one, boy. one, one boy. son, you know, and it's important for the fathers, yeah, especially the fathers, to be in their lives. And that's a wonderful thing that you're yeah, doing, brother, Thanks, out bro. there, you now, know. Now, well, all, all the things that you have under your belt, how do you make time for your kids? They just, you know what I'm saying? I work and then 
they come with I don't live with them. I wish everything could have been copacetic with mm-hmm. like the situation. I ain't never, you know what I'm saying, planning to not be with my kids' moms, but they they just come to me after work. After work I, every day. Wow. I make time for them all the time because like nothing else is is more important. Yeah, like I, there's nothing like what else is more important, like, you know what I'm saying? Exactly. And my philosophy is like like I'm I'm mature, like so mm-hmm. I I see what's really important and what's really not important. Like that's what's up. Word. Wow. Now how did you get a name for yourself? Because I are you from Bridgeport? Yeah. Okay. Yes, I do know that. I just wanted to answer. Now, are you from Bridgeport? You, That's like saying it's Drew and Pops you? from Bridgeport. <laughs> <laughs> how did you get your buzz? Like, how did you start? Because you're very popular out there. Like, it's it's someone can say your name and you don't know what the heck you gonna hear. Yeah, where? So nah, I don't know. People, it, it started off as they love you, then they hate you, then they love you again love you type again. of shit. Dr. Yeah. Jay Z for that line. So like. I don't know. People just people know me like cause I was when I was in high school I was the baller like I'm a, I went off state two years and I did my thing so I was a basketball player so people started. did you hear that E another one I yeah. definitely, another one definitely who was nice who so played you ball? showed, showed that you was who? A, that was an, I'm saying that was another one under your belt there uh, you go uh, balling so <laughs> yeah. ball too yeah did you went to school for balling yeah I got man I did four years on college ball wow. I didn't score a thousand but you feel me I did all, I so where did you play at in high school. I went to um, Bassick my junior year in Stratford High. I graduated because my father got deported, so I had to move to Stratford. Oh, that's what's up. Now, what is your background? Columbia. Straight Columbia. What? That, that, that's why that's that weed. Why, that's, that's, why, why that's, that's, that's why that weed. That's why that weed. Columbia got some garbage weed, man. Oh, oh man. He done disrespect. Turn the mic off. But, that, <laughs> but brother, so rapping... <laughs> Right, you Foster it parent, yeah, I, I, I got, I got to get yeah, all the notches. I try, I try to just be low, like I don't really, I'm not rapping. Kidding. Foster parent, I never really mentioned this to no interviews. Ar- artist, you know, um, wow, uh, landlord. Here yeah. you go. Uh, father, <laughs> a teacher, teacher. <laughs> you believe that? Baller. Yo, I can't. You on your way yeah. to being a mogul, That's brother. I, said. I, I can't. I could not believe this. Yeah, we're... This is crazy. Now, what, is your, what, is, what do you plan on doing in the future? I just want, um, I say the same response to every interview. I just want commercial property. That's like, it. That's, that's my goal in life, like, to own commercial property. Like, that so is all it. that you're doing and all the hustling that you're doing. Yeah, that's for that. Yeah, it's for that. You know what I'm saying? The and ho- the crazy thing is you're so low key with it. Yeah. You know how you got brothers that 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 own one house. Yeah. Go out, just... grab a Benz. Nah, you know what know I mean? And, and and they out there like I don't even I don't even, I'm not a designer dude. I don't wear nothing. You know what I'm saying? Like And you stack that, that bread. It were. That's, That's it. what I'm talking about. Now how's your about. relationship with your parents? Oh, my mom died when I was seven. My uh-huh. father um got deported when I was sixteen. And you stay here. Yeah. So it's just me and my sister. And, and my you, kids. And your kids. Yeah, my rest of my family in Colombia, so I go to Colombia like twice a year. A lot. Yeah. So does that make you more more motivated because of the situations that happened when you were growing up? Um, separate yeah, from your definitely. Father and then, you yeah, know. definitely, definitely. De- like that's that's where I get my hustle from. Like like I was telling you y'all earlier, when I was um a junior in high school, my father got deported, uh-huh. and that's who I live with. You know what I'm saying? So when he got deported, I had to live with my girl. Wow. I'm, so I'm in high school living with my shorty. Yeah, so my senior year, senior summer when I graduated, she broke up with me. Like, we, wow. we broke up and she moved to Florida. <gasps> so now I'm like, hold up, hold up. The fuck? So I'm, I got to move to Columbia? Like, that's what you're telling me? Oh, wow. Like, wow. You know what I'm saying? So you had to make a real serious decision. Yeah, it was like, so, step up or yeah, go exactly. down to Columbia. So, yeah, so what I did was, like, I went to college. And I stayed in college for six years. And that's I, what's up. <laughs> so at the end of... Stayed on campus do you still f- talk to that young lady? Nah, we, do, do I mean, y'all, we do cool you see, now. Like, you see it? Yeah, we so cool. So I, I, I know it's a new song. <laughs> it's a new song be. coming up. Talking be. about look at me now. <laughs> because I know. Nah, she still be hitting me up. I, 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 sh- why not? <laughs> she still be you know, me you're, 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 you're an entrepreneur. You rap for fun. <laughs> for fun. <laughs> making I like bread. That. I like that. You're about to go. Do shows with Waka Flocka. Yeah, that's we're, crazy. That's, it's that's dudes be that have been though. doing it for years and can't get that type of clout. And he just yeah. doing it. Yo, that Waka show going to be crazy. And that's something uh, that... Webster Hall. Yeah, Wednesday. 420. This Wednesday. 420. 420. 420. 420. 420 is big for you. Yeah. 420. Uh, four, yeah, hey, yeah. actually, 420 is big for me, too. Because you want to know why? Oh, shit. It's my mother's birthday. Oh, okay. 420 is my mother's birthday. Happy birthday, now, baby. Now I know why she's a little crazy. Because, <laughs> no, you know, she was born on, on 420. Day. And she don't smoke, though, so... You know, but now, happy birthday, mom. Is there anything mom. that you want to tell the viewers that they may not know, may not understand, or you think is out there flowing that you want to stop the rumors? 
Wanna... Yo, just get to know get to know me before you make a judgment. Like, cause people be crazy. I don't know why so much salt get thrown on my name. Like, <laughs> yo, n- n- motherfuckers don't like me out here. It's that light skin. It's the light skin. Yo, it's crazy. Cause I'm like, yo, I don't bother nobody. Like, I just, yo, if you pay attention on my snap, I just be in my house. I don't do and nothing. You get so much hate. Well, yo. I mean, you are make, I mean, think about it. You're making moves that people want to make. You had there's people that go to school for art. And still can't get theirs displayed. You decide that you want to rent out a space. Nah, I don't rent it out. I'm the gallery manager. What? Like, I run that gallery. Excuse me. <laughs> Word. Excuse me. Yeah. Wait. <laughs> so you mean to tell me you're the gallery manager. Word, yeah. Resort decide place. to put something together at a huge gallery. Yeah, it's yeah. not just any gallery. 33,000 square feet. And put something together for free. And filling it up every yeah. time. Every 500 plus time. people. Yeah, word. Actually, I was on the front page of the newspaper last week. What newspaper was that? Because we knew. every newspaper. Every newspaper. Yeah, it's um, it's a it's Sunday. There's an insert called Con- um Connecticut Magazine. Uh huh. And they're run through um, what's the name of the uh, media group that runs all the newspapers? You know the name of it. I don't know. All right, so there's this one media group um that runs every newspaper. Uh huh. So they so Connecticut Post, New Haven Advocate, Hartford Current, New London, whatever. They all on Sundays. They all got an insert called Connecticut Magazine mm. through Hearst Media. Okay. It's Hearst Media. Okay. So Hearst Media published that and put me in the insert to every ma- every serious? newspaper in the state. Yeah, yeah, that was. Oh big. yeah, we need that. Yeah, that was big. That was that. Big. That is pic- so what's up. The picture was mad big. Like I'm like, yo, why y'all put such a big <laughs> picture? I mean, you doing big things. Yeah, you should a, be yo, very. It's crazy. You should be it's very funny that you said that. that because I asked the lady. I'm like, yo, that's a big ass. Because usually the newspaper spread is like quarters, but they put me as like. Three quarters, wow. and then on the bottom they put like the three other dudes, like like three other people, oh, <laughs> like wow. mad little so, pics. Like, uh, <laughs> yeah. Wow, no, no, and yeah. that's why he get hated on. And, he got and a and big pic I mean, with three little. You've done and you've accomplished. I mean, rapping wise, literally a year. I had no idea it was just a year. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest with you because I heard about you last year, but I thought yeah. that it was. Don't make me. Last I'm year. gonna be honest with you. I thought he was doing it for a long time. So when he approached me with it. Shout out to Ferris. He was just like, you listen to my boy? And I'm like, nah. And, you know, he let me hear the song. Oh, no, I'm like, no, that's off, right? Of, you know, oh, yeah, he's showing me love. Definitely. Right. Um, and that, and that, was, that was, like, really, like, you know, I'm like, wow, a year? So that's that's deep. That's yeah. that's what's up. Yo, that's like, a, it's mad. It's like um, a couple of people. On, I don't even know everybody on the remix. I just flooded out. You just put it out there. Yeah, wow. I said, yo, so Harry, you, you want to get on it? listen to the remixes? Oh, yeah, I, I listened to them all. Oh, okay, okay. Like, I remember this is one dude, like, he got on a remix and tried to come at me. On your remix <laughs> yeah. of your song? I'm oh. like, yo, I'm like, yo, dog, you coming wow. at me? He got mad because I ain't sending him the beat. You wow. know what I'm saying? That's some cannabis LL yeah, Cool so, J type so, stuff so right he, there. He got on the track, he was like, oh, something, something. So now I'm going to smash the beat. Saying because you ain't want to send it, I don't remember his lyrics, but he killed it though. Wow, oh, damn, shot the seat. Look, showing love, still. showing love. <laughs> but so you actually <laughs> are, I say, the undisputed mayor of Bridgeport because I see <laughs> you, say that. Oh, that's I, crazy. yeah, yeah, cats, cats, cats gonna get mad. So, but I see you around town yeah. taking pictures with the mayor. Oh, where, taking pictures boy. with, you know, saying to all the people. So how do you feel about what's going on in the world right now with, with this presidential thing? Exactly. Because you, you're, 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 in, you're not in politics, but you, but are. you are in politics. Yeah, I was actually going to run for um, councilman. Oh. But at the time, one of my houses were listed in Waterbury. That was my address. Oh. And I was going to run for the 123rd district of the hollow. Wow. You know what I'm saying? And I was going to win that. I know I was going to win that. Whew. Like, but That's a lot of I was register. It really ain't. It's just a fancy title. Like, all oh. you really, all you really do is oh, take the, all you really do is take the complaints of the people in your community. Uh-huh. Like, if they need something, and then you bring it to the board. Like, but they now, pay you like you twenty be, bands. Do you think that you would be effective though? Being that you have a community now to look after, yeah, and all that you do. That's under how your you belt. come up. Like, that's the only way to come up is to build through your community. That's why I do all my art shows for free because. Subliminally, they gonna remember like, yo, Phil, Phil, Phil. That's his show, Phil, Phil, Phil. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. So they got, you know what so I mean? why not go out and support yeah, when you've like, been giving back for? I love for Bridgeport. I don't know nothing else. I love just love Bridgeport. Like I don't know. That's no what's other city. up. Like, and that's Bridgeport what's up. definitely show love yeah, back to everybody right. that shows love to them. Yeah, now nah, Bridgeport's definitely showing a lot of love because they never, they never um, supported artists. I never seen a lot of support. Nah, like, they really they don't. Love. Not yeah. you're absolutely yeah, correct. Yeah, they so really don't. They showing mad love. That's what's up. So for the people. 
again, that don't know you, is there any last things you want to let people know what's coming up? You know, what you got going on? Just keep up with me on social media. Um, Plug it in. Yeah, um, just film my swag on um, Instagram. I'm about to cancel that and just do my film my swag music page Ooh. and just stay with all that. And um, like I said, in a month and a half, I should be signed. You know what I'm saying? There's three labels that's hollering at me right now, major labels. Like, I don't even know if I should say the name. No, nah, don't, 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 don't put that out there yet. Don't drop it. Don't put that out there yet. Don't drop it yet. You know what I mean? But like I said, they hollering at me. So um, it's going to happen, man. And I'm just like, yo, like I said, me, I'm just like, I'm nonchalant. And I really don't care uh, at all. But like I said, you give me that money, I'm not investing none of that money <laughs> into music. I'm going right into real estate. <laughs> wow. Real estate. Go straight to real estate. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, that's that's the goal. Like, he goes he go some studio money. For real. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I got I studio mean, apartment money. Like, say, imagine imagine owning this building right here. So yeah. you got the tenants upstairs, the store right here, store right there. Like, Jeez. That's it. like It's crazy. That's what I'm talking about. But fill my swag. It was great having you here yes, with the sir. Critical Crew. So we got to wrap this up. I'm your boy, Big E. It's your girl, White Jones. And we the Critical Crew, and we're, we're out. out. Dope, girl. Thanks.